So experiencing a professional wrestling event in person for the first time as a 14 year old with my 11 year old brother, that's what got me into the ring. That's what hooked me. That's what made me go to every single event as I was growing up. It became my preferred choice of escapism. It's why I wanted to get away from school and homework and maybe stuff that was going on at home with my family. I wanted to go see these guys compete. I wanna see these wrestlers fight. My name is Drew Gulak. I began training in 2004, and I made my debut on April 16th, 2005. I don't like to describe my style in the ring, uh, but a lot of people compare me to other wrestlers. People like Eddie Guerrero, Dean Malenko, Ali Anderson. Bob Backlund. Daniel Bryan is another person who I look up to and have been compared to. One person who I spoke to uh, was Jake the Snake Roberts. Years ago, I was very lucky enough to catch him at a show and get some advice from him. And uh, something resonated with me that really stood out. And he would go, I'm from the old school. And then he'd go, no, I'm from the school that burned down. And they built a school on top of that that's now the old school. So the school before the old school, that's the school I'm from, and I relate to that. So people describe me as a no-nonsense wrestler, and that's what I do. I, I go in the ring and I try to get the job done. I, I'm, I'm a student of the game. I do study it and I do focus on it. I've always been that, that kind of way. I always have overanalyzed things and tried to pick things apart and relate to them and study them as, as much as I can to kind of gain the upper hand in, in any situation. Maybe it's because I've always been kind of reserved and timid. I was never very outgoing, especially growing up. My brother was always the more outgoing person. I was more introverted. And, uh, you know, that comes from how you're brought up and how you're raised. And I was raised in a big family in, uh, in Philadelphia. A family specifically who, you know, went through financial struggles and all that kind of stuff. All that fun stuff. And that, that kind of led me to becoming the Drew Gulak that you see before you. So, a lot of, uh, a lot of getting beat in the shape. What motivates me more than anything is knowing that I've seen so many people come and go through this thing, this thing that we call professional wrestling, that I call professional wrestling. Um, I see a lot of people who chase their dreams or do not chase their dreams. And I don't like that. That just really bothers me. I think if you feel something and you connect to something, you go for it. And as long as you feel fulfilled, that's the goal. I think that's the goal that more people need to reach out for. And I think I've always been around people their whole life who feel like they have to conform to a certain way to kind of make their way in the world. And that's not happiness. I've seen it. That's it's despair. It's desperation. Um, I'm a firm believer in chasing, chasing your dream. And uh, for some reason, this makes me happy. And I've seen so many people fail at it. And I'd like to set an example and also help others to continue on that path. <laughs> 